couple of weeks ago, it was discovered that a critical bug within the Android operating system allowed apps to break the ability to make emergency calls. And while the original app in question now has an update that fixes the issue, the underlying bug is still present in Android. So in today's video, I'll be showing you an application that you can install that will check and see if any other applications that are installed on your device are triggering this bug and break emergency calls. So it didn't matter if you were trying to dial 911 or 112, 999, 000, or any of the other emergency numbers around the world. It seems like the Android bug that was discovered last week prevents all devices from placing the call if there is an application that triggers the bug. So the original application in question here is the Microsoft Teams app, and it seems to have triggered the bug only if you have the application installed and you were not logged into your Microsoft account. Now since then, the developers behind the app have pushed out a new update to prevent it from happening with the Microsoft Teams app in the future. But the bug itself is still present in the Android operating system. Even though it was patched out of the application, because that's just easy to do, a firmware update is needed to fix the underlying issue here and we're told that this would not be released until January 4th at the earliest. So until your device gets this new bug squashing firmware update, I want to share another application with you that you can install that will check and see if any applications are triggering this bug on your smartphone. The application I'm talking about right here is called the Phone Account Abuse Detector. And we can simply install this third-party app from well-known Android developer Linux CT to see if, again, that bug is present on your device with an application that is currently installed. I'll be linking to the GitHub page in the video description below. For anyone who wants to read up on the project, you'll also find a download mirror for the APK in the video description as well. This application needs to be installed and opened up to see if there are any apps that trigger the issue. So you can see I have installed the application here. All we have to do is open up the app and it will check and see if there are any apps triggering this bug. If there are no apps triggering the bug, then you're going to see a green check mark right here. And you're going to see that there's only one emergency call mobile network account here. However, if you have an application that is abusing this bug, whether that is intentional or not, the phone account abuse detector app will look like this with a yellow sign here telling you that there is an application abusing this bug and you're going to be told which application it is and again this is how the app is detecting which apps are abusing this bug so if you install this app and see a yellow sign right here be sure to check which application is in this list and then you now have the option to either disable or uninstall that application so that you can place emergency calls again. And that's really all there is to this application. All we need to do is open it up, let it check for the applications we have installed and it will tell you if something is abusing that Android operating system bug or not. So I highly recommend anybody who is running an Android device install this free third-party app to make sure that you are not experiencing this critical bug 
so that you can place emergency phone calls when needed.